Sure, because you're yep. giving us what we need in the kitchen, right? Well, you know, the whole lineup, that's why I love Kitchen HQ, is yes. designed for the home cook, right? Absolutely. We designed everything to make sure life in the kitchen is easier, faster, cleaner. Yes. So, you know, it kind of makes sense. The cast iron speaks for itself. Yeah. Uh, those concave cutting boards, by the way, I love those. They can yeah. hold up to a cup of liquid. Oh my gosh. So think about any time you're chopping pineapple, watermelon, yeah. you're resting those steaks that you cooked, the chicken, yes. all those juices stay on the board Perfect. as opposed to running off. Perfect. Those are really cool. And you know what, speaking of chopping, yep. can we talk about, you give us the essentials, but you make them cool, right? This oh, is sure. a magnetic knife block. And I'm showing you, you're going to get the knives and we're gonna yep. talk about that, but you get this knife block. So when you're done chopping, you've cleaned your knife and you're ready to put it back, it's magnetic. It stays put. Uh, it's a sale price of $29.95. You'll get the magnetic knife block. You're going to get the three and a half inch paring knife, the five inch utility knife, the five inch Santoko knife, yep. and then the eight inch slicer knife and the eight inch chef knife. Yep. Um, what you would pay for just the magnetic block, you're getting all of it. On FlexPay, it's just under $10. You can see the way that that breaks out. And if you want to go ahead and do it while we have them, because everything <laughs> Chef Masood touches flies out the door. So I'm just telling you now, you can start shopping for it. <laughs> okay, so this, let's talk about this knife set for a second. First of all, these are all the knives you need. Sometimes you see a set with 20 knives. Yes. You don't need 20 knives, right? <laughs> okay. You've got the chef knife, you've got the slicing knife, that's great for carving your turkey or breaking apart your watermelon. You've got the santuca knife, that's great for top-down slices. Mm -hmm. And then you've got the two little paring knives for little jobs. So okay. number one, you get everything you need. Number two, if you've ever seen those knife blocks where you yes. put the knife in the block, a yes. couple things happening there. One, you're dulling your knife, which is bad. Oh. And number two, guaranteed, you're putting your knife in there probably not bone dry, right. and that moisture is now trapped in that knife block. Oh. Not good. <laughs> so I love displaying my knives like this. I think it looks great, yeah. it keeps your blade sharp, and it keeps everything hygienic. This is so really, really smart. I never thought about that, but you're right. I have a knife block at home that I've yep. had for years, right? For sure. Uh, there's no telling what's going on in there. And you don't want to know. <laughs> like, you know what? If you've had that knife block for 20 years, you don't want to know what's living in there. Oh. And I guarantee there's people out there with the mystery drawer. I always talk about the mystery drawer mm -hmm. where you open it. There's a mismatch of knives, old can openers. God knows what else is in there. Right. Get rid of the old knives. If you have old knives and they're probably dull, right. those are the dangerous knives. Okay. When a knife is dull, mm -hmm. that's when it slips and that's when you get hurt. Get the new knives. Nice, sharp. I mean... You can't fake how sharp the knife is, right? Look at that. And I want to show you this also. Check out this diamond pattern. Mm -hmm. it does a couple things. The diamond pattern in that knife stops things from sticking. So if ever you've, you know, sliced through a potato with all that starch and things are sticking, or you slice through a big block of cheddar cheese and it sticks to your knife, yes. you find yourself scrubbing it. Yeah. Really difficult to clean. That makes it non-stick and super easy to clean as well. Okay. This is ceramic coated non-stick as well. Really great to clean. And this is the thing, I know that a lot of you are watching and you are and you know you need new knives. We, we, we yeah. know it. We know if our knives are dull or if we are always reaching for that same one because it's really the only one that works for you. Yeah. Um, and you're saying, he's right. I don't need 20 knives. I'm not, for a, the regular home cook, we're not doing all of the things that you see on TV or, or in restaurants. For These sure. are your essentials. This is an easy way for A, for you to see where the knives are. So if one's missing, you can instantly see it, but also easy to put back, easy to use, easy to clean, go for it. It's not, these are not expensive. On FlexPay, they're about just under $10 and we'd love to be able to send them right on out to you. And you're doing uh, vegetables, which is what we yep. prep every day. Every day. And you know what? There's no substitute for a sharp knife. Mm -hmm. You gotta have sharp knives. And for sure, in that knife block that you talked about, Yes. You don't know which one you're reaching for, right? Sometimes you reach and you think it's the paring knife. Sometimes you reach and you think it's the slicing knife. Right. So displaying them out like that keeps your blade sharp and also lets you see what you're grabbing. Mm -hmm. I think it looks cool too. I think so too. Like I just leave it in the back of my counter 
and just love how it looks parked in the back of my counter. This is going to be a thing when you get these home and have them in your kitchen and folks come over, it's going to be a conversation piece. They're going to say, how are those knives just hanging up there like For that? For sure. Um, because it's magnetic. The knife block itself is magnetic. And then obviously it's sticking to the steel and the knives as well. The knives are beautifully balanced. They feel good in the hand. I even love the handle that you've got yep. here. Yes. You know, you mentioned something so important with knives. They've got to feel good in your hand. I love the ergonomic shape. It really, and this is, let me just show us. This is how you hold the knife. So if you're holding the knife like this, that's not the way. If you're holding the knife like this, that's yeah. not the way. You oh. want to cradle your knife. Cradle it, and we've designed it for that purpose. It okay. feels so good in the hand, so light, and I want to highlight again that diamond pattern, the fact that it's ceramic coated, guaranteed. If ever you've sliced through potatoes, starchy mm. potatoes, sliced through cheddar cheese, you find that sometimes things cake onto your blade, right. super hard to clean. With that ceramic coating, non-stick, easy to clean, and that diamond pattern lets you glide through whatever you're slicing. Oh my gosh. Really great. You know what, I'm learning so much, and I know I'm not the only one, because I, I don't hold my knife like this, but I do yep. hold it like this. Cradle I, it. I, I, I never knew. Yep. And even when you cradle it here, because you do have that textured diamond pattern, you can see it just feels better in your hand. You've got a better control over the knife. I want you to get these. For I do. Sure. These are your essentials. And if you're the one who does the cooking, you're also the one who has to do all of the prep work. Make it easy on yourself. Yep. You can call us or you can shop on hsn.com and you're getting all uh, five knives and the magnetic block as well. Guaranteed, there's the mystery drawer out there. I always talk about the mystery <laughs> drawer. If you've got the old knives, the old mishmash, you know, smorgasbord of old, dull knives. Why do we do that? Why do we keep all those old knives? Emotional attachment. <laughs> I don't know. And I'm all one for loyalty. I get it. Right. But like, let's upgrade that drawer, clear yes. it out, Yes. put this on your back counter. Yes. I think it looks cool. I Just how too. it looks is really great. I do too. It's, it's made of acacia wood that's what you're seeing here so it's got a beautiful striations of color I think it's gonna go great in any kitchen you've got your knives where you can see them and some of us display our pots and pans some yep. of us display our like our wooden spoons and those kinds yep. of things it just kind of makes sense that we would have a knife block like this where we could see what we're reaching for and when we're pre doing our prep work we want the control that that knife gives yeah I mean you, you can't you can't cheat it. It's either right. sharp or it's not. Right. And if you can get your cucumber that thin, that's how you know it's sharp. The fact that that block is such a chic wood as well, yes. I really like because it kind of fits any kitchen decor you've got, right? Mm -hmm. So whatever accent colors you've committed to with that Kitchen HQ lineup, if you bought the red, the black, the teal, everything matches with wood. Yes. I think it's really, really beautiful just to have on the back of your counter, and then you find yourself reaching for it more often. Mm -hmm. You know it's gonna stay sharp. It's not going into an old block or an old drawer while right. still wet. Right. That's not what you want. That's not what you want, no. and with this, that you're you're not doing that anymore, okay? This is all magnetic, and I'm showing you. Doesn't matter any, which knife I pick up. I just picked up the the um, chef's knife that's yep. right next to me, and it is that, ma that magnetic piece um, that you haven't seen things like this. We just don't. We're so used to the same old thing, the same old knife block and I say that because I have an, a knife block that I've had for not 20 years but, <laughs> but seriously maybe 10. It's getting there. I don't know right? what's in those slots and, I, and nope. I never thought about it but it's the only part of the kitchen it's the only utensil that you can't fully clean is, are those old knife blocks. With this, no worries about that. This is yep. magnetic and this is where you're going to keep st and store all your essential knife set, which is what you're getting today. Um, at, if you were to purchase everything separately that you're getting, you'd be at over $89. Today, you've got it on sale. You've got it on FlexPay. We know we need it. I want you to call us or shop on hsn.com. And if you maybe just recently got a, a, a wedding invitation and the couple mm -hmm. the happy couple is registered somewhere get them a better set of knives i don't know what they registered for this is a better set of knives than whatever they registered for um, because these are the essentials this is what everything that you need love that idea for a wedding gift mm -hmm. first time homeowner yeah. i mean you need a good set of knives right? right and the last thing you need is an old set of knives sitting in your drawer sitting in that knife block 
that has been there, like you said, 10 years. Look, <laughs> I know my mother-in-law is not watching, <laughs> but when I go to her house, oh. her knives have got to be 30 years old. Oh, you're in trouble now. And Jeff. I'm telling you, are you watching? <laughs> I'm telling you, those things are dangerous, okay? <laughs> so if you've got the old dull knives, now's the time. Maybe I should buy this for her, actually. <laughs> Right. Maybe they don't go over there more often. She's in need. And that's you the know? thing. If you can't even remember the last time when you bought your knives, then it's time for new knives. For if sure. You, if you can't even remember a time where your kitchen didn't have that knife block that you're moving around and wiping underneath, it's time to get a new set of knives. These are the kind of things, they don't, you, you, your old knives are not going to last forever. They yep. weren't meant to last forever. Yep. These are the things that make cooking and prepping that much easier. So why not have the set that you need? I know that we only have about three more minutes left in this hour with chef um, but this is your time to go ahead and pick these up we have just one color because it's the color of nature it's acacia wood and it's the color that's going to go no matter what your decor is no matter where you decide to put it in your kitchen it's a it is a it's going to be a conversation starter and a conversation piece but really every time you reach for them you're going to say this is the exact knife i needed for sure and i love that you mentioned you know no no matter what your kitchen decor, that really matches whatever you've got going on. You know, we've been doing some segments from home. The next time I'm back home, look behind me. You're gonna see on my back counter, I keep my, my beautiful knife set with yes. the wood block. I just think it looks great. Yeah, it does. And, and you've done vegetables. You've done, yeah. so, you know, some softer fruits that if you don't have the right kind of knife, your fruits and your vegetables are getting squeezed. Yep. You know, you're trying to cut a tomato and all you see are the seeds coming out because yep. you don't have the right knife or your knife is too dull. You'll notice that you're getting all of the knives that you're going to use. I will be honest, chef. Yeah. I have a knife block. I only ever reach for the chef's knife. Is that, is that? <laughs> well, you, because you've probably given up on the others, right? Yes. You, you don't want to guess which is which and where it is. And yeah. maybe deep down you know that there's something going on in there, right? <laughs> so if you've got the old knife block, I want you to be honest with yourself and say, have I ever put in mm -hmm. a knife that's not 100% dry and let it just yes. sit there in the knife block? Right. When you have this 